You know, a lot of times patients will ask us, justifiably, how is our dendritic cell technology different from someone else's? We're not the only people out here using dendritic cells. It is not a secret that they run the immune system and are biologically critical. So it makes sense that a lot of different people and groups would want to try to use them in the fight against cancer. But typically these efforts have fallen short. Why? An analogy I like to use is it would be like walking into a house, ending up in a dark room, and trying to figure out which light switch to turn on to get the lights on. And a lot of groups are, are playing with different switches and different outlets, and some of them might turn on a lamp or get some light in the room or do something. But our whole, the whole basis of what we say is that it's all kind of irrelevant. You didn't walk into the right house in the first place. You have to get your dendritic cells fixed at step one, the level of immunological ignorance, the fact that it didn't see the threat in the first place. And only then can you possibly explore adding other stimulations and other modalities to power things up. If you do not start at step one, it's going to be a tough go. For more information on how our platform is unique and powerful, please visit us at immunoscene.com.